staycation. They call that a staycation. Yeah, it's not. When I was your age, they didn't have that word. They invented it. But yeah, and you can do many things when you stay at home. Because when your mom and dad are off, they can maybe take you one day to the lot, maybe one day to the train, little day trips, or maybe just to the beach, right? Nice and local. And visit mom, grandma and grandpa, aunts and uncles, lots of things. Okay, pick on you. Yes, you. What did you do? Where did you go on your last vacation? Um. To the island? Yes. And what did you do there? Uh, I did you go swimming? Um, you went to an island and you didn't go swimming. Built sand castle. <laughs> you built sand, but you did not go swimming? You don't like swimming? No. Oh my goodness gracious! You're just a sand castle builder, okay? Good. Pick on you. Where did you go on your last vacation? I went to the beach with my family. Ah, and what did you do there? I swam in the sea and ate my food. Ah, and your, your tents? was perfect. I swam. Very good. Well done. How about you? What did you do on your last vacation? Um, on the holiday, I, I, I went to the big uh, bay. bay. Oh. Ooh. I day, I, day I, I enjoyed the seafood and swam, swam in the swamp sea. Yeah, did you know that last weekend I went to Vinny Bay too? Oh. I, I have a friend there now. He has a coffee shop. And he took us to a, a hotel that has a private beach, and he looked after our stuff while we went swimming. This is Kathy, myself, and two of my friends from Fanti. Yeah, it was cool. What seafood did you like to eat there? Uh, I have fish. Fish? Crab. Crab? Yeah. Shell. Yeah? Everything. <laughs> yeah. yeah, everything. It's all yummy. Okay, you have your hand up. What did you? Where did you go on your last vacation? Ah, and what did you do in the train city? Went to the beach. Yeah. Did you know that two weekends ago I went to the train and I went to Vin Pearl and I went to the beach and I swam and the sea was beautiful. It was amazing. Mr. Dan Tung have just come back from Vinland. Yeah. <laughs> well, from too. Yes. Did you? What did you like the best? Did you like Adventureland? Yes. Yeah. Did you get to go to the zoo? Yes. And the water park? Yes. Oh. And did you see the water the water light show at night? Yes. Ah, that was good, wasn't it? The laser and the LED lights was amazing how they could make figures in the water that was spraying. Yeah. And what was, did you do the, eat the buffets? Did you eat the uh, at the buffet in the restaurant? You did it? No? I did. Oh, lots of yummy food. Very good. Okay. And who did you go to Vin Pearl with? With a lot of people. So did I. I went with a bunch of uh, teachers. Yeah, it was cool. Did you have to pay money? No, <laughs> so did I. We did good. We got a trip to Van Pearl for free. Okay. Mm, you. Let's pick on you. Where did you go on your last vacation? Now, I think Vinnie Bay is probably my favorite place to go. I love, and I have another friend who has property there who is going to build a hotel 
have, and she has property right on the sea. Yeah. And she's going to build, try and build a hotel on the mountain looking down to Pity Bay. Yeah. So I hope one day I will be able to go and stay at her hotel. Yeah. Oh. Um, yeah. Okay. Where did you go on your last vacation or holiday? I went to the beach. To the beach. And what did you do there? Play games. Did you go swimming? Okay, you went swimming. Okay. And you know what? It's okay not to go swimming because lots of people don't know how to swim. I went to Vinny Bay and my two Vietnamese friends, they come originally from Phan Ri, right on the sea, like Phan Rang, and they don't know how to swim. But they can float. Yeah. So it was so hot last weekend, like it is today, they just floated and we had fun. And yeah, it was cool, very good. Mm, you, where did you go on your last holiday? Where? Yeah, and what did you do there? Oh, very good. Last time I was there, I visited friends too. Very good. You don't think I was there, did you? Clay and Da Nang, Hoi An, yeah, lots of places. How about you? Where did you go on your last holiday? The Lat. Ooh, nice. I would like the Lat today. It would be, I think, cooler. What did you do in the Lat? I ate strawberries. Oh, you ate a lot of strawberries. Did you? Did your fingers get red? Did your fingers turn red? from the strawberries? Or was your tongue red? Yeah? yeah? Were they yummy? Yeah, very yummy strawberries, right? Yeah, good. Did I pick on you? Yep. So, it's the Wakano people. Uh-huh. It's hard, they're hard to say because all those languages are different. Just like Vietnamese, just like English. In Canada, one of the uh, most common tribes or First Nation communities is Ojibwe. So if you speak Ojibwe, I would come up and instead of saying Sin Chow, I would say no. I would say thank you. I would say instead of come on, I'd say Migwich. Migwich. Yeah. Migwich, and that is thank you. Come on. Yeah, so a total different language. My granddaughter, or our granddaughter, she is indig indigenous. Her mother, and she comes from the tribe, barefoot. She is of the barefoot tribe. Yeah, yeah, and it's funny. That, the name of those Indians, that was their tribe. That is what their community was called. Good. Is Canada's Thanksgiving the same time as the Americans? I just told you. Is Canada's Thanksgiving the same as when the Americans have their Thanksgiving? Yeah, it's earlier. Yeah. And you can't say it. What food do they eat at Thanksgiving? Who said that? Okay, as long as I wasn't here. Good, you're listening. Good. Yes, um, and it's a gigantic meal. Just like you guys have a gigantic me meals at Tet Holiday and other festi festivals, they do too. Thanksgiving is a big deal. Usually in Canada, I will cook, do most of the cooking, but for Thanksgiving, Miss Kathy kicks me out of the kitchen because she can make super turkey. Yeah, she makes delicious turkey. And it takes most of the day because she's got to clean the bird out. She's got to stuff. She puts a whole, two, maybe two loaves of bread in it, stuffing. And yeah, she ties, she wrestles and she ties it up. And then she puts it in, we have gigantic ovens and she cooks it low and slow. Maybe three, four hours. And she makes gravy, oh yummy. Potatoes, carrots, corn. Fresh rolls, buns, lots of vegetables, corn, carrots, and yeah, 
delicious and dessert. Yeah, makes me hungry now. Any questions about Thanksgiving? You went to the beach. Did you build sandcastles with her? What did you do at the beach? You had food? Did you go swimming? Did you play games? Who did you go to the beach with? <coughs> Your mom? Your dad? Your last holiday? I go to the beach. Yeah, I, I didn't go, I went. I went to the beach. And what did you do? Ah, beautiful. Did you hear his tenses? I swam, I ate fast. So before. Well done. Good. And what was your favorite food? Pizza. Did you eat pizza at the beach? Uh, yeah, picnic probably, right? Yeah, or barbecue. Okay. Did I pick on you? Did I ask you already? No, not yet. <laughs> not yet. Oh, everybody, no, don't ask me. <laughs> oh, and you too. What did you, where did you go on your last holiday? Oh, to the beach. To the beach? You guys all went to the beach and had a big party, didn't you? <laughs> and you didn't invite me. <laughs> what did you do at the beach? I built sandcastles. Ah, you built sandcastles. Anything else? <laughs> Did you go swimming? You didn't go swimming either. Okay. Yeah. Lots of people know. It's okay. Good. Pick on her. Where did you go on your last holiday? Dalat. And did you eat strawberries too? How many? I lost count. There was a lot of berry eating. Okay. And what else did you do in Dalat? Oh, I went the last time I, I went uh, the last, I went to the big uh, market in the center of the city. Yeah, that's huge. And did you go to Big C? Yeah. Oh, that's huge. Yeah, and they have a nice big restaurant with lots of yummy food. I like it. Good. Okay, who else did I pick on? You. Did I pick on you already? <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> Not yet. Nobody's volunteering. Where did you go on your last holiday? Oh, excellent. Good answer. I visited grandparents with my family. And were they happy to see you? Mm, okay. And they may still call that in the USA, but not in Canada. Then they were called indigenous. But now they don't call them that either. What did they call them? They used to call them First Nation, but that is, they don't call them that either. Because that is just the communities. Okay? There's many. My granddaughter is. Oh, I lied. They used to call them Aboriginals. Now they call them indigenous. Okay, so if you're if there's a person from India, they're Indian, right? You're from Vietnam. You're Vietnamese. I'm from Canada. I am Canadian. But North American natives, they don't want to be called native. Now they want to be called indigenous, first people of the land. It means first people of the land. Okay, so, question. And all the answers are in front of you. First question is, what's the name of the festival? 
what is the name of the festival? Thanksgiving. And in USA, just so you know, our the Thanksgiving is later and we have ours in Canada earlier. And we have had indigenous or North Native American Indians in Canada for 5,000 years. So for as long as Vietnam has been, we had indigenous people. Okay, when do Americans eat a big Thanksgiving meal? Yes. In the fall. 